Don't tell me you're still sleeping by this time. Did you sleep well last night? No, Mom, I did not. I... I went straight into a meeting when I came. Sorry. I was supposed to call you later today. Sorry about that. Well, you don't have to. I have called already. Mom, it's not intentional, okay? I'm sorry. No one says it's intentional. Oh, is there any problem? What happened? Nothing really. I... I wanted to ask you if there's any salon around your neighborhood so I can do my medicure. Salon? You want to fix? Excuse me? Wait, Mom, is, is this why you called me? The reason you woke me up? Are you telling me it's not, it's not a good reason to call you? You know I don't know your neighborhood very well. Wait, are you complaining right now? No, I'm not complaining. I'm just... I'm just saying... You, you, Mom, now... You know what? Don't worry, I'll fix it myself. You, you don't have to do that, okay? Allow me, Mom. Besides, you said you don't know anywhere in the neighborhood, so... I'll just... Oh. I'll check the internet, okay? I'll check for saloons around and I'll send you the location, okay? If you like. This woman will not kill me. Oh my God. Good day, ma'am. Good day, how are you? Welcome Thank to Fetty Hair and Salon. Thank how, you. How may we help you, ma'am? Thank you very much. I want the total service of this establishment, except the spare, of course. Of course, ma'am. Um, one of us will attend to you shortly. And how long is this shortly? Uh, just... Um, okay, like 10 minutes. Okay. Welcome, ma'am. Thank you. Good afternoon, how are you? Fine, thank you. Hey, good day. Good day. You look so beautiful. Your face is fine. <laughs> thank oh, you. So, how do we attend to you? Um, I just want to wash and remove my natural hair. Okay. Yes, please. Okay, let That's me get things ready. Okay, sure. Thank you. Catch you be fast. Are you ready for me now? Okay. Thank you. Um, I think I should keep my bag here. Thank you. What's up? He's on his way. I thought he cancelled after keeping us waiting for over two hours. I'm at the salon already. Oh, please, please, just cover for me. Cover up for me, please. I'll be there shortly. Okay. Um, excuse me. My dear, I will have to come back later, okay? I have an appointment, please. Oh, okay. Yes. Yes, 
It's um, so. What's my bill? Um, Ketchi, is your pedicure? Yes. Okay. Your money is seven five. Okay. Um. Please, I would like to ask. Do you know that girl? Which girl, ma'am? The one that was sitting over there a few minutes ago that dashed out. Both of you seem to be acquaintance with each other. Not really, ma'am. She comes here often. Oh. She sounds like a good girl. Yes. Lizzie, that's her name. She's one of our best customers, ma'am. Really? Yes, On that note, can I have her number? Mm, no, madam. I cannot help you with that. It's, our, it's against our policy. I know, but this is very important. I'm sorry to disappoint you, madam. I can't help you. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Ma, this is more than 7,500. I know. Mm -hmm. You can keep that while you give me the number. Wait, mom, let, let, let me make sense of this. You went and asked for a girl's number. For me. Mom, why? Why would you do such a thing? I never asked you to do that. And you don't have to, son. Because your mother knows exactly what is good for you. What is good for me? Okay, now I have done the biggest part of the job. All you have to do now is call her. I'm not doing that, mom. It's a no. Not happening. Why? 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 Because it doesn't make any sense, mom. It doesn't make any sense. What am I supposed to say? Okay, I call up and I said, my name is Jeffrey. I got your number from my mother. Who got your number from where you make your nails? It, no, it's not happening, mom. I'm not doing that. Young man, are you in bed with some lady over there? Is it that girl? Obama or whatever you call her name. Mom, I mean, I'm, there's nobody here. Ufoma, that's her name, okay? And she's not with me on this trip. There's nobody here. Come on, Mom. So why are you so stubborn to call this girl? Mom, I just told you why. It, it, it doesn't make any sense. Well, young man, I don't care however lame you think this is. You think you are going to be able to find any decent lady by being stuck? Working every day of your life and being with all those indecent home wreckers girls, you are going to pick up your phone and call her. Mom, mom you just you don't just sit there and make decisions for me. I'm, okay, I'm a, I'm a man, and it does This is not. Hello, hello, mom. No, I'm not doing anything. Not doing it. Not doing it. Hey, Bube! Chichi, you guys should hurry up. We're running late. Elizabeth, are you still in the shower? No, I'm done. I'm just getting ready. I thought your exam was today. Was it moved? Yeah, it was moved to 3 p.m., but it's still today. Okay. Um, sis. Yeah? You had a lot of calls last night on the landline. I could barely study because it was disturbing me. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry about that. I'll check whoever it is later, but just leave, leave, leave the phone like this, okay? Hey, Mr. Man! Chichi! Where's your sister? Wait, 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 wait. let's go. For work. I don't have time for this.
Listen. Hi, Mom. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. You sound so excited. Yes, yes. I'm really, really happy. I and Jinx, we are making progress, and that's making me happy. And it's not because you have called her? Uh, no, I, I didn't. Uh, Mom, that's not why I called. I called to know how you're doing. Am I not allowed? It's two days already. Why haven't you called her? Don't tell me you're so busy that you didn't call. Oh, okay, I called her. Yes, I called and the number was not going through. Mom, I, are you sure that is a correct number? Because it looks like a landline. What? What do you mean if the number is correct? Don't tell me this girl gave me a wrong number. After giving her such... What? what? Mom, did I just hear you say you paid a girl to get the number? Hello? Mom? Mom's headache, I guess. You won't be surprised. Do you know my mom actually paid somebody to get this number? The girl's number? I'm telling you. Oh, <laughs> so she finally found a wife for you. <laughs> no, that, that's not funny. No, she must be worth it yeah, for your mom to go that length. Uh, that's I'm not telling funny. you. That's not funny. It's not funny. <laughs> Who said it's funny? It's hilarious. Yes, mom finally found a wife for, for the mama's boy. <laughs> Madness! Oh my god. Ah. Well, well, she will not kill me. She will not kill me. What? Uh, <laughs> now she did plot. He plots everything. No, the fact she actually paid a girl to get another girl's number. No, but first of all, you should check. For her to go that length to pay, the girl must be worth it. So you just have to wait and see who the girl is. What kind of nonsense is this? Eh? What does this girl take me for? A fool or what? What are you on Dala? Yes, hello? Yes, you have reached your How can we be of assistance? That's not the voice of that girl. Can I talk to the other girl? Which girl? The other one. You know what? Just hold on. I'll call you back. Is it a scam or what? Hey! Ifoma, what have you just done? Tell this to the anchor. I paid 20,000 naira. Not even getting the right number. Hey! <laughs> Hey, you see why it's not good to run faster than your shadow? Anyway, I'll go back to that salon. It's either she gives me the right number or she pays me back my money. Now, lady up here. No, she can't eat my money. Now, give me a message. Ain't no qua. <laughs> she thinks one becomes rich through charity. Mba. She will give me the right number. Mukule. Oye, nyemye.
Bring up what are we just there? No money, let's talk money first. Money. money. Hello? Hello? Who is this? That. Uh, mister, I should be asking you that. I say you're missed call on my phone. No, 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 woman. No, I, I, I didn't dial your number. You, you called me. So I, I should be asking you who you are. Um, I would not have your number if I did not see your phone number in my phone. As a matter of fact, you called me a lot of times and I was beginning to wonder if it was somebody I owed some money. Somebody I did something to? Do I owe you? Hey, hey, uh, uh listen, um, <laughs> I, I don't know what all this is about, yeah, but I think you should check the number you dialed. It could be a wrong number. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah check it so you, you, you dial again, yeah? Really? Okay, I'm sorry for wasting your time. Yeah, yeah, I accept that. Whoa. Jeez. Such a freak. Yeah. Well, I'm supposed to cheer you guys. You can only you can only be high to meet the most high. That's very important. <laughs> Hey. Did you cheer? Cheers. To, to highness, to highness, <laughs> to highness. <laughs> What's wrong with this man? Okay, come and open your door now. Don't tell me you're still asleep by now. Hey, stop shouting into my ears, man. What is it? What's the problem? Come and open your door. My door? Yo. Yeah. Tell me you're still asleep. What's going on now? You know we're supposed to be there at most 9 a.m. and this is 9.37. See, guy, we can't afford to lose this case. Else, Mrs. Biggs will have our asses. I know. I know. Just give me five minutes, okay? Five? What did you even drink? Guy, I can't believe you, you, you didn't even drink as much as I did last night. And I had a very passionate, steamy night too, till late in the morning, yet I woke up before you. I already told you I'm sorry, okay? And please don't shove your night escapade on my face. I don't like it. <sighs> wait, 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 wait. If you're trying to call them, don't bother because I already sent them a text message. I told them we we're gonna be late because my colleague is kind of sick. I'm not sick. And I'm not calling anyone, just want to call my mom. Oh, oh. can't do without your mom. Mama's boy. Wait. This number called me. I answered. When did I answer this number? Ding, 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 ding. If you ask me, <laughs> now I go. <laughs> Look. 
Liz. Elizabeth, do you want to come out here? Sis, can you just leave me alone? I don't have strength to stand. If you don't have strength to stand, shouldn't you be taking some meds? Should I get you some paracetamol? Huh? Hello? Uh, hello, hi. Listen, I don't know who you are. If you want to keep breathing on the phone, I will hang up. It's either you speak up or I hang up. It's your choice. I, uh, um, no, 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 please, 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 just hold on. I, I am, uh, uh, you, you just talk to her and get over with it. Uh, mister, I don't know who that person that's talking beside you is, but I'd advise that you listen to him. I, I, you know what, can, can I call you back, please? I, I'll call you back, okay? Maybe I should block this number. Have you not called me again? Elizabeth, do you want some aspirin? Yeah, what's going be your problem now? I should be asking you that. You've been wanting to talk to this girl on phone. Now you had the opportunity. You can't even. You you're lost of words. Or do you do you want your mother to do the work for you? Yeah, okay, can you just control this? Your chest It's getting out of hand. I don't like it. What's it with you and my mom all the time? I don't like it. Okay, okay, I'll call her back. No, 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 no. Yeah, I'll call her back. Thank God. <laughs> Is it? What, ma? How good is the day? How dare you? How dare you give me a fake number after giving you such an amount of money? In that wala! Damn, what they shout. Calm down. What made they pursue me for here? You should have thought about that before defrauding me in such a cruel manner. I'm sorry, ma. It's not our number. I know that already. See, ma, you know, she later came that day and, and gave me her real number and said I should call her the next day if it gets to her turn. So why didn't you inform me? But I what? How would they call you? I don't get your number now. So? Hello? Uh, yeah, hello. What is surprising is that you're calling at all. I... I'm sorry I'm calling this late. Hope I'm not disturbing you. Do I owe you? What do you want from me? Uh, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. Um, let me take a wide guess. I owe you money. And you have come to collect your money. Is that how you got my number? Because if I remember correctly, I paid off all my debts. All right, first of all, I'm not a debtor, okay? So let's get that out of the way. Ah, secondly, I think it's sheer luck that your number dropped on my lap. So it's my lucky day. But that's not the catchy thing. Do you want to know what's catchy about this? What? Your voice. You have an angelic voice and it's, it's captivating. I can only imagine what you look in real life. Oh, please stop pulling my legs. <laughs> no, I'm not. I mean it. Uh, listen, why don't we make this official? I mean, uh, introduce ourselves formally. You should be curious as to who I am, right? Introduction. Mm-hmm. Okay, so my name is Ikena. What's yours? Uchiana Sike. Uche, Uche, Uche is supposed to be a guy's name. And who says that Uche is a man's name? All right, you're right. Uche is still a lovely name. I like it. That's unisex. 
Is that the only name you have? Any English name? You can call me Catherine. Catherine. Uche is better. I stick to Uche. Alright? Um probably I'll call you some other time, okay? Let me let you rest. Okay. Alright? Okay. Bye. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I know. I guess you slept well. Oh, you bet I did. My night was good. Wow. It's been a rough week, huh? I'm telling you. But we nailed it anyway. Yeah. So I really appreciate you for being here. I've never pulled such a big contract before. Nah. And I don't say that. This is a win for us. Okay? This is our win. You know how we do it. I believe you. I believe you. I just can't wait to see the look on Mr. Morrison's face. <laughs> Oh, man. Wow, wow, wow. Where is hey. this guy? Uh, Who's there? Yeah, I caught him. Okay, the... Yeah. I'm not, uh... Oh, he's here. Oh, yeah, just this one. Thank you. No, that, that'll be right. I think so. <laughs> oh, well, let's go. <laughs> Maggi. Ah, uh, my man. Mom? Mom, I'm home. God. Mom! Oh, man. Where is she? Mom? Hi, Jeff. I'm, I'm sorry, have we met? Who, who are you? Uh, um. I see you two have met each other. What is? Mom, what is going on here? She's Elizabeth, the girl I told you about. She's beautiful and lovely, isn't she? <laughs> Mom. Can I see you for a second? I'll talk. You're just coming from a long trip. Mom, please. Did I do something wrong? Not at all, darling. Don't worry. Just go back and do what you're doing. I'm going to take care of that, okay? Okay, Mrs. Anozi. Are we back on it again, Mrs. Anozi? <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, come on. Mom. <laughs> I'll be right back. with the attitude. handsome. What happened? You didn't tell me you're coming back home today. Mom, who is she and what is she doing here? I invited her over. That's Elizabeth, the girl I was telling you about. Isn't she lovely? 
Well, how can you invite her into this house without informing me? Why would you even want to meet with her in the first place? Because you seem too busy with your job to do yourself some good. I'm doing you a favor, son. <laughs> and just to make sure that receptionist girl is not joking with me, I had to go there and have an appointment with her. Is there anything wrong with her? And you lay down the prospects of marriage, which explains why she's here. Mom, you gave me a number to call. And I asked you not to call the number. Yeah, but I called it. I called the number. I told you it's the wrong number. You shouldn't call the number again. Now you should discard it. Or if in Wally. But Mom, I, I called the number. This is Elizabeth. That's the person I was telling you about. She's here now. Discard that number. I was in here. You've clearly zeroed your mind on this girl. What do you know about her? The little I know about her is okay. It's fine by me. The rest is left for you to find out. Besides, she's a good girl. That is all that matters. And I think both of you will make a perfect match. <sighs> will you come down and join us for lunch? I'll be down. Yeah. Soon join us. I don't think so, Mom. Oh. It's taking a while and it's. This is good. New recipe or what? Hmm. I wish I can take the credit, but no. But Lizzie prepared it. She wanted to spoil me with. She wanted to spoil me with her delicious meal. Hmm. Yeah, this is good. Really good. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. As a model? You can say that, but I haven't gotten any serious gig though. Hmm. It appears they are probably more beautiful than I am. I don't think so. I, mean, I don't think so. I mean, look at you, you're very beautiful. I am beautiful? Oh, please don't be modest. <laughs> I know you know you are beautiful. Thank you. But seriously, how do you balance this with school? Uh, it's difficult, I won't lie. Mm. Pretty difficult. But once there's a dream, there's a drive, right? Yeah, I totally believe that. 
just don't want you to give up. Don't give up on it, because I know a major gig is coming soon. No, 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 no. I'm not. I've grown to realize that dreams don't come true just by wishing, but by diligent effort as well. You have wisdom as well. That's good. Unlike some other girls that will just wait for mana to fall from above. <laughs> I like that. Hmm. You're a man of wisdom yourself. And passionate about what you do. I admire that. <laughs> Finally, why are you grinning and smiling? And <laughs> why are you looking so happy? I am happy, very happy. <laughs> so I take it that you got a gig, right? Uh, so this something way better. Um, where are my babies? Are they asleep? Hey, baby, he's been it's been crazy since morning. He has a flu. He's been running temperature. Oh. I managed to bring it down, but I hope it gets better by morning. I hope it's not that bad. I gave him some medicine and he's sleeping. But anyway, I want to hear all the details. You too like gist. It's but you see this one, this particular <laughs> one, I need to sleep with a memory, okay? So some other day, after I'm done freshening up and sleeping and having my beautiful sleep, <gasps> bye. Dad! But you are going to give me all the dirty details in the morning. You are not escaping me! Now look at that. You see that? That is beauty right there. Are you sick? Why would you be taking this like a joke? I thought you said you were talking to the other girl. You're not seeing this beauty. Guy, what is your problem? Now? Yes, I know I'm talking with the girl, but my mom corrected the mistake. I thought I told you. Oh. Of course you did. And as a good mama's boy who will always do what mama wants, marry the girl she single-handedly picked for you. Okay. Okay. That's not funny. All right. Bad joke. Bad mm. joke. Mm. Is it supposed to be? Guy, you told me you've been talking to this other girl. And both of you seem to cling so well. Then you got home and your mother throws another chicken at your face. You can't even stand up straight to tell her what it is you want. Guy, what's your problem? No, 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 no. We think they work you now. Is this your problem? Why are you taking this person out? Oh, God, I am worried about you. This isn't right. You know, this is marriage we're talking about. Hmm? Not a joke. Hmm. Until a month ago, the talk about marriage starts giving you chills. But you were busy sneaking around with your secretary. Oh, then your mother shows up and you suddenly want to get married. Okay, fine. I understand. But well, this is definitely not the right way to go about it. All right? I'm holding on what I know is right. I'm not backing off from the truth. My yesterday might not be too smooth. But I know tomorrow holds something good I'm holding on what I feel is right I'm not backing up from the truth My yesterday might not be too smooth
Hello? Wait. <laughs> Are you serious? Of course I do yoga. How else do you think I maintain this body? No, for real, uh, you don't strike me like the kind of yoga girl, to be honest. <laughs> then what would you have taken me for? Weightlifting? Yeah, like a uh, no exercise kind of girl. Oh, wow. Too bad I disappoint you then. <laughs> You always do, you're full of surprises. <sighs> Am I? Uh, talking of surprises. Wait. You do? Oh, spill, spill, tell me. What is it? You know it won't be a surprise if I tell you, right? <sighs> you have your ways with words. You. <laughs> <laughs> please, 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 you know about me. Just hurry up so you don't go late to work. All right, babe. I'll talk to you later, okay? Okay. Bye. coming to this big place all by himself. No house help. Eh? Hey, is this how he's going to kill my daughter in law Elizabeth with work? <sighs> okay, so much. Hey mom. Okay, now how are you? Okay, good morning. <laughs> how was it? It was good. Whew. Oh, mom, I'll just uh, take a shower, okay? I'll be down. Hey, what's up? Uh -huh. How are you? Mom? Hey, hold on. I've been meaning to ask you. When are you planning on getting a house help or a housekeeper that will manage the affairs of this house? The work here is too much now. I remember the last time I came, I oh. told you, you brush it aside. Now it's important. Mm, okay, Mom, I told you I'll look into it, all right? That I was promise. what you said. But you didn't look into it. Or do you want to kill my daughter-in-law with work when she comes? Mom, I promise you, I'll look into it, okay? Don't worry yourself, all right? Trouble not yourself, okay? Uh, let me just shower. 
Jeez. Hello? Hey, uh... <laughs> you woke? Hey, sorry. I was drinking water. That was my mom. <laughs> I know, don't worry. Someday you get to meet her. I'll allow you to, to talk. Mm-hmm. What? Are you scared? You don't want to talk to her? Huh? Hey, why do I have this feeling that you are running away from me? I'm not. Are you sure? I mean, come on. We've been talking all this while and you've refused me calling you on video call, refused to send me your pictures. Hey. Am I disturbing you? No, 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 of course not. Then what is it? Hmm? What is it? Because you said you live in this city and you don't want us to see. It's not fair now. Hmm? It's not that I don't want to see you. I just... Uh... Okay, fine. Let's put a rest to this. How does Friday sound? Wait, you, you want us to see this Friday? I haven't got much going on at the office, so no late nights. And my sister is done with her semester exams. So I'm so sure she can watch them for me for a while. So how's your schedule? Got anything important you're doing that day? Yes. Uh, no, no, not, nothing at all. <laughs> I'm not doing it. I'm so useless on Fridays. You know what? Even if I have something to do, cancel. Just to see on Friday. Okay, good. You should get ready for work. I don't want to be the reason you're reporting late to work again. Yes, sure, sure. Uh, Friday. <laughs> All right, you take care, okay? All right. I feel good. -da -da. Friday. <laughs> hey, sis, are you... You are not ready? See, I'm just confused. I don't know what to wear. See, see, you're beautiful. Anything you put on will look good on you. This is a date, okay? It's different. I don't want to go and embarrass myself on my date. Hmm. It must be special. Oh, please, it's not like that. Not special. You kept him off the radar for months and you finally decided to see him. Of course he's special. So, that is why I am going to make sure you look your best. Tonight. Uh, okay, okay, but you know this is not an award night. I so. don't care. I'm your stylist for tonight. Let's see. What do you have here? Yes, ma'am. Sis, you honestly need to change your closet, honestly. Okay, but this is this is okay. nice. This is good for Let's you. see, let's see. This is going to be like Kenna. Wow. You. Hi. You. You look. You. I can't even find words. For a man with so many pickup lines. Yeah, pickup lines fill me here. You look stunning. Wow. <laughs> Thank you. And you don't look bad to yourself. Thank you. <clears throat> wow. Sir, I hope I didn't keep you waiting too long. I'm so sorry. It's okay. This is more than I expected. Okay, so what kept you? The traffic and all. Mm. Jeez.
So this is your place? Yep. This is my place. Nice. I love the neighborhood. You do? Mm-hmm. So, uh, today was... Uh... Amazing. <laughs> really. I, I have not had so much fun in a while. I can't even remember when last I had this much fun. Well, all that is about to change. Huh. Listen, uh, I know you're probably thinking this is a bad idea, but it's not. Okay? I'm not him. And I will never break your heart. I will never hurt you. That I can assure you. All I need is for you to give me the chance. Please. You know what? I I think I should just go in now because I've been out way longer than usual. Okay. Oh. Good night. Mm. Good night. What's wrong? Why, why are you up by this time? Where hey, did you go off to? I was out. With whom? <laughs> Mom, I don't think you need to know that. Elizabeth told me that she has been calling you. You're not picking her calls. So who is she? Mom, I wasn't in, in any meeting. You were not in any meeting. They came now and your former. Tell me, who is she? Mom, come on. This was not the plan. I mean, we had a deal. You get to allow me to choose. Choose? Choose? I get to allow you to choose. Ikena, are you telling me you're seeing other people besides Elizabeth? Ikena, if you not achieve I told you Elizabeth is the best thing that could have happened to you. No, Mom, I, I beg to differ. Come on, this is my life. I get to choose and not the other way around, Mom. Well, if this is the reason you came to monitor me, I don't like it. Oh, I don't like it. Oh. Just go. Are you directly asking me to leave your house? No, Mom. No, come on, tell me. Are you directly asking me saying... to leave? You cannot. Guys, we don't have all day. Let's go. What's keeping you guys? All right, come. Come and eat. Come. All right, sit down. Keep, keep, just keep this one first. I like to play too much. Keep this one. Sit down there and eat. Sit here and eat. Where's your auntie? Lizzie! Oh yeah, let's 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 go. Oh yeah, Ibube, come this way. Elizabeth! You guys should start eating. I don't want you guys talking on this table today. Oh, Jesus. Elizabeth! I'm coming, sis. I eat. Good morning, sis. Good morning. Are you okay? I'm good. You don't look good. I'm good. Or do you want to talk about it later? Maybe. Yes. 
Well, your food is in the kitchen. Do you want me to get it for you? I'll eat later, sis. Eat your food. Eat your food. I'll leave you behind in this house today. Just drop the kids off at school. What's wrong with you? Nothing. I'm fine. No, you are not. Have you seen yourself? You look a mess. Do you want to talk about it? Wait a minute. What? What is it? Was, is it him? What did he do? Did, did you guys have a fight? It would have been better if we fought, honestly. Because I'll punch him. See, see, it really would have been better if we fought. Liz, I would know the reason for this radio silence for two days now. Well, maybe he's busy with work. Can no. You? Yes, he might be busy with work, but Jeff has always been like this. One minute we're fine talking and having a good time. The next is totally different. I don't get it. It's just not fair. Okay. Now he must be a psycho for making you upset. Who the hell does he think he is? I understand that there is work and then there is you. He should be able to balance it out. Yes, exactly what I've been telling him. But he just won't listen. <laughs> Aren't you going to get that? No. Okay, fine, because I need to talk some sense. No, 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 no. Who wants your bite of his ear? You know me, I'll, I'll punch him if I see him. That's a sign. I think you have to go for the one your mother personally introduced to you. You think that solves it? Shake it now. That solves it. What if she's the one? The one? How can she be the one? <laughs> it's not possible. Guy, this the lady in question is 35 and you're 30. She's a divorcee with two kids, and you're a single guy with no responsibilities, guy. So, if there is any chance of, you know, any of them being the one, I think that should be the sexy Lizzie. She fits into the category of a woman that any single guy would want. It's not that simple, bro. Okay, it's very simple. Now you hold yourself. Cut this thing off. Even she told you herself she doesn't want it. Oh, well, I want it. I do. In fact, I think I'm deeply in love with her. I'm, I'm telling you, bro, I'm falling deep oh, for God, this it's girl. It's not possible. You can't. The mother man knows here, I know, will never allow you to date someone like that. Well, it's my decision to make at the end of the day. Not hers. All right? <laughs> Man. Besides, I don't want to make a big mistake. You're already making a very big mistake by leading two women on. And one of them is asking for an out, but you don't want to hear it. Guy, <laughs> this whole way they deep when you go back fire. He no go for you. <laughs> you don't know that, bro. You don't know that. I don't tell you finish, you. You know, say me, I go always dead here when he go back fire. Pine, I... My uncle, I to suck away, suck away.
I refuse. Okay? I refuse. Excuse me. I refuse. Who's this? What's you? Ikena. It said no, okay? I, I refuse to accept your excuse, all right? It's a no for me. It's a no. Ah. Why are you calling me at this time? Are you drunk? Dr no, I'm not, no, I did not drink, okay? I'm not a drunkard. Why are you drunk? I'm not a drunkard, okay? Why, why? Why are you doing this to me? Guy. Why? Why? Come decide first. Okay, why can't you just come decide first? Why can't first. you Relax just love me? Where are you now? Was I wrong to love you? Was I wrong to feel how I feel for you? I fell for you over the phone. Was I wrong? You cannot wear you, just tell me. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Just tell me where you are, damn it. Ah. Uh, Okay, they disturb you, they create you for this neighborhood. I'm neighbor sitting right here outside. Stand up, I beg, where would they go? Waiting for you to open the door to your heart for me, okay? Okay, they enter motor, where would they go? Wait, wait. You know what people they live here? This baby no go come out, where would they go? Why, but, but why is she being wicked on me? Let me they ask. Oh God, they go, they go, they go, Hello? I beg. Are you there? I'm not going anywhere. Hello? Hello? Ikenna. Ka. What are you doing? Catherine. You came. She came. You came. Uh, uh. What happened to him? You came. I decided to wake up. Okay. Oh, man. Good morning. Good morning, baby. Oh, man. What are you doing here? Don't you have a house? This is much his house as well. Besides, you should thank him. He's the one that brought your lazy self back home last night. They're not asleep for dining. That food will be chop for here. Yeah, I made it specially for you to help with the hangover. Thank you. Uh, 
What happened? What, what, what did I miss? Mm. Jose, what happened? <laughs> <laughs> What do you they even think like? Oh my God. Do you know that it took the grace of God for their neighborhood not to call the police on you last night? Kai, just answer me first. Did she come out? Before uncle? Huh? No, why is she no good day? In fact, she was the only person that knew somehow how to get you to shut up. Guys, this is a mess up. Well, she saw me in that mess. <laughs> oh my God. God, you for stop me now. You tell me where you did go. You not tell me now. Yeah, um, besides, that, uh, that's by the way. So, what do you go do about her? Like, what will you do about her? About who? Please, you know. It's clear. It's, it's just clear like the day. Now, the other lady, what him be that? Catherine, now you love, now you like. So why not discharge this one? Focus your mind on this one. Me, you not lose focus. Okay. Alpha, why are you switching sides all of a sudden? What's happening now? Nobody will wait and say it will never work out between us. Nobody you. I know which other tell you, guy. The best thing is to set your priorities first before we start thinking of how to maneuver this issue. Yes, because I know your mama, based on who she be, she don't go green. Or are you planning to be leading the both of them on? Leading them on? Am I? No, I don't think I am. I mean, besides, Catherine never looked my way yet. I mean, not yet. But you like her? Yeah, I do like her. Funny, I really do like her and I wish she could just give me a chance. As for Lizzie, I'll probably just keep her around for a while. Just to get my mom off Catherine's back. Oh. And I don't want her to know what I've been up to. That's just it. Oh. Mm -hmm. If I show you the planner, it's cool. It makes sense to me, but... Yeah. You know, see, women matter. You just have to be very careful to avoid repercussion. Mm -hmm. Now, you they tell you, may you shun this one, face this one. But, now you be the man for the picture now. Man. So, not in spoil. My yesterday might not be too smooth, but I know tomorrow. The kids, they're not home? Oh no, my mother is in town, so they have gone to spend the weekend with her. Okay. Are you sure this is all you, you want? Oh yeah, this is, this is okay, this is good, thank you. If you say so. So, why are uh, you here? Um, well, I guess you've seen me in my worst moment. It wasn't pleasant. <laughs> to be honest, that is not me. <laughs> I, I say, I totally get it. I get it. <laughs> is that why you're here? No, uh, we still haven't finished this. I thought I made myself clear. And I thought I made my stand known. Look, I don't care about the age gap. I don't. I don't, okay? I don't care that you were married. I don't care that you have kids. The truth is, I... Are you telling me you want my respect for you? I respect you immensely for that. Listen, okay. The society frowns at such combination. Society will always frown at everything. Who cares? I don't care about what they think. I, I don't think we shouldn't either. Look, I, I came here for an answer because I know. I know you feel something for me. Maybe not love yet. 
But whatever it is, let's explore it together. You don't understand. And it's because you're not in my shoes. Do you know what's in store for us if we decide to go on with this? What's the worst that can happen? The society will make us their business. Who cares? I don't care about that. I don't want you to care either. Alright? Because no matter the choice you make, they will still talk. That's people for you. So would you rather prefer to sit at the back seat and watch them talk and be a spectator? Or would you rather take charge, take the wheel and move on with your life? You're smooth. That's what you are. <laughs> Come on, I'm just trying to say the truth here. I'm holding on what I know is right. I'm not backing off from the truth. My yesterday might not be too smooth. But I know tomorrow holds something good. I'm holding on what I feel is right I'm not backing up from the truth My yesterday might not be too smooth But I know tomorrow holds something Chichi. Okay, okay. I'm going to wait here when you're done with your homework before you have your snacks. Continue. Keep doing your homework. Good boy. Continue. 
It will be the good boy. Well done. <laughs> oh, look who is back. Who missed me? Come, 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 give me a hug. Come, 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 come. I missed you. Oh, I missed you. Uh, I missed you, sis. How are you? Since some people are pretending not to miss you. I miss I you. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Homework. Yes. Thank you, Thank you. Homework. It's nothing. Okay. Oh, wow. It's pretty much. I mean, I haven't seen you this happy since Andrew. Study guy has your perfect medication. Medication? <laughs> Oh, well. Well, if you put it that way, you might be right because it gives me butterflies. It does? Please! <laughs> wow, this is a big move to the next stage of your relationship. <laughs> He's gonna ask you to marry him. Um, Liz, no, no, slow, <laughs> slow down. <laughs> Just slow your rolls. You're moving too fast. What? Well, that's all the signs. I mean, he likes you. The next thing you meet his parents, they like you too. And he pops the question and you say yes. Well, I'm not expecting anything. I don't want to expect anything because I just... Left for me, I want to take it slow. You know, get to know him first. I don't want to rush into marriage again. Sis. This will work. Okay? You're one of the most amazing persons I know. And you deserve to be happy. Truly. Thank you. So does that mean you're finally going to introduce him to us? Uh, this, I need to see him. Okay. The kids need to see this man that's making their mother okay. look this way. Like, look how you're glowing. That yeah. can be arranged. That can be arranged. <laughs> mm, maybe after we come back from visiting his mom. Look at you blushing. <laughs> Hey. <laughs> okay. <You're silly. laughs> okay, okay, that's fine. That's okay. <sighs> Just go to bed, sleep well. Because vacation is over. Mm. Tomorrow now you're hustle. Mm -hmm. And you have school tomorrow too. I know. The mice is safe. I love you. I love you. Wow. I'll see you in the morning. Sure. Sweet dreams. Make sure those children are sleeping. Vacation is over. I've been working all night. <laughs> What you've just said, Ikemi. Repeat it. Mom, I know you heard me loud and clear. No, I don't. So it's true then. You're seeing someone else while you're seeing Elizabeth. Ikemi, what is wrong with you? Ogini! Mom, look. I understand. I know you love Elizabeth. I get it. She's a good girl and all. And so is Catherine. Ikemi. In a chip kawalo, that Catherine is better than Elizabeth. Mom, this is not a matter of who can do it better than who. It's all about what? It's about who I'm comfortable with, Mom. And Catherine gives me the peace of mind I desire in a woman. Hey! What's well, son? Mom, please, can you just meet her first? Then we can have this conversation. Meet with who? Excuse me, Mom. Meet who? I look good, Auntie. I look good? 
I look good. Look at me. I look good. High five. High five. High five. Your auntie has always been beautiful. Mm hmm. <laughs> Let me take a little. Let me take a shot. Mm. Ah. Hi, sis. Going somewhere? Yes, I am going out. Clearly. It's the weekend. Where are you going to? Audition or uh, your boyfriend? Boyfriends? Sis. We haven't seen each other in a long while and I really miss him. But what about Chinemi and Ibubia? I'm supposed to see Kina's mom today. Look, it's not going to be a problem. I'll be back before you know it, okay? It's okay. I promise, sis. It's, it's okay, it's okay. You good? I'm fine. Sure. <laughs> Thank you. I hope I look good. Fantastic. Your sister is a beauty. Fabulous. Uh, Thank you. <laughs> Have fun. Bye. You're watching TV. Have you done your homework? Yes. Everybody, have you done your homework? Yes. You're sure? Yes. Oh, come on, Lizzie. I'm not upset. I... I totally understand. I left them behind with Joyce. Okay, sis. I'm really sorry once again. Come on, I'm not angry at all. I, I, see, what is, what is, what's going on with you? You said something about not seeing your boyfriend till now. What's his problem? I don't know. Seriously, I don't. Just let me talk to you later, okay? Sure thing, Liz. Have fun with your guy and hey. You take care of yourself, okay? Don't let his mother scare you. You've got this. Why, is there any problem? Apparently so. And I know she doesn't want to talk about it, but I know I have a feeling that she's having a problem with her boyfriend. This is like the first guy she's getting really serious with after she left the ex about two years ago. Wow. And it's already like she's hitting rock bottom. I mean, but why, why are men like that though, seriously? Like how? Like, had to please, had to figure out. And yeah, I was thinking it was you ladies. Of course, it's you girls, not us. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I, feel, I feel bad for her though. Yeah, but they'll figure it out, I'm sure. They'll figure it out. Don't, in, don't interfere in love things. Uh -huh. uh, <laughs> I'm not interfering, I just... Beautiful. You own this place? Technically, not yet. But after my mortgage fee is being paid, I can say I comfortably own a house. Wow. That's refreshing to hear. Mm -hmm. I mean, a young man of your type having thoughts like this. <laughs> hey, come on now. I'm sure the inside will thrill you more. Come, let me show you. Come, my mom can't wait to see you. I'm sure she's so excited. Mom! Mom! Mom, she's here! Mom! She's here! You know what? Just sit. Okay. Sit. Make yourself comfortable. Okay. Okay, my mom. Mom! Mom, she's here! What is she doing here? Why would she be here? She's just she's your fiance. She do me just make jest of by bringing in another woman into this house. Tell me, mom. Tell him. Where is she? Where is that gold digging prostitute? Please. 
Mom, mom, this is this is unfair. You shouldn't have. Sis. Sis. Sis, what are you doing here? I I should be asking you that. What are you doing? You're supposed to be at your boyfriend's place, right? Yes. He's your boyfriend. Yes, sis. This is my boyfriend, Jeff, and this is his mom. You, what are you doing here? How, his name is Ikena. How can your name be Jeff? That's his Igbo name. What's, what's oh, going on? Are you sisters? Yes, mom. She's my sister, the one I've been telling you guys about. Oh, what's, my God. What's going on? Wait. She's your sister? You're, you're her sister? Shit. shit. What? Shit! Shit. What? Shit. Shit. Jeff, Jeff, wait, Jeff. Shit. Shit. Jeff. Shit. Jeff. Oh my god. Jeff, Jeff, Jeff. Is she, is she the reason you've been acting the way you've been acting lately, Jeff? Oh my god. Is she the woman you just introduced to your mom? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I must be out of my mind. Oh my it was god. such a pleasure to meet you, ma. Oh my god. Shit, shit, shit. Shit. You were cheating on me. You were cheating on me with my sister. You were here with her. You were, you were cheating. Oh my god.
What are you doing? What's going on here? What's the look of him doing? Well, that's that's what I'm asking. Oh, please! But you can't! You've been seeing my boyfriend. My boyfriend, Katrina, and now you want to pretend like you care? Really? I'm not pretending, Liz. I didn't even know the guy was your boyfriend until today. And I met that guy through a wrong phone call. And we, we got talking and apparently we're relating fine. He told me his name was Ikin. How How was I supposed to know he's Jeffrey, your boyfriend? I don't know. It just, it just doesn't feel right that you've been seeing him and you're the reason he's been acting different towards me. Okay. My own sister. Right. You. You, Catherine, you. I understand that you're upset and you're angry. I'm equally angry and upset, but I am not the enemy here. It's the idiot who played the both of us. What are you even saying? Are you taking sides with him? No, don't, don't, don't go there, okay? I am not taking anybody's side. It's not like he told me anything to start with. I just need to leave this house, please. Oh, come on, don't be silly. Just let me go, I need to leave, please. All right, you can be upset, you can be angry, you can do whatever you want to do, but you, it has to be in this house. I'm not going to let you take your things and walk out of that door. Liz, this is your home. Where are you going? Liz, come on. Please. Fine. Fine. It's, it's your house, okay? Fine. It is not my house. It is our please house. Me, please. Liz. to me. If only you had listened to me, all this wouldn't have happened. Listen to me and do away with that number. No, you won't. All this wouldn't have happened. Oh, gosh. I, I know, Mom. I know. It seems you know. Yes, you know. Not before now. Two sisters. How could you do that? How could you do this? How? So, so. It's okay, darling. It's okay. It's okay, darling. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I should have just listened to you, man. If I listened to you, I would have. I wouldn't have been in this mess. Yeah, you don't have to blame yourself too much. No, no. no. It was selfish of me. I didn't just hurt two women. I hurt two sisters. Mm. A family. I don't even know how to face either of them. <laughs> but you have to, somehow. Although I know <laughs> no explanation you give will be accepted, but somehow you have to sound reasonable. Reasonable? I don't even sound reasonable to myself. How am I supposed to sound reasonable to someone else? Life. I don't know. I don't know what to say, but you just have to try. You just have to try.
Mimi, why is Aunt Rizzi going to come back? Soon enough, I guess. Just eat, eat, eat your food. Just quickly eat your food so we can eat two other things. Easy. Okay. Get married. I mean, wasn't that the aim of this whole mission? Before you sabotage it with your smart moves. But mother, I can take it. Think of everything you have done to Elizabeth. Think of it. Did you see her demand for an explanation on leaving you? Anna Majuge, the least you can do is by doing the right thing. Asking her to marry you. It's going to be a miracle if she agrees to marry. Of course, mom. I'll marry him. He doesn't even need to ask. All you have to do is just put the ring on my finger. Hey, it's a good one. It's a good one. Where did you get that? From your room. You did a good thing hiding it away from me, waiting for the right time to pop the question. What is wrong with you? You have no right snooping around in my room looking for this. Son, you don't talk to her like that. I found it. I actually gave it to her for safekeeping. Besides, it's hers, right? Right? Yes. Good. Then do the right thing by proposing to her now. Yes, yeah. just hold on. Yeah. 
You don't miss it. <laughs> start afresh. You will start from the beginning. Mm. <gasps> Miss Beth, will you mind? Yes, 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 yes. Oh, yeah, I will. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? Really? <laughs> yes, I'm so happy. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Telling your father already. Already. Oh, what is it, honey? Ah, say that. We're going to have somebody is coming into this house. So we're going to have a plus one soon enough. Plus one? Yes. I don't understand. Elizabeth is getting married. Wow! <laughs> Are you serious? Yes, 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 I am. I just got off the phone with her just now. Wow! Wow! God, isn't this amazing? It is, my darling. I thought you had forgotten about his family. Yes, not. You had your own plan. Yes. Yes! This is good news. Good news. Why is she called only you? You have started. That's your phone. Pick it up. Let me call her. I have to call her. What, Mom? She's getting married? Uh-uh. Why do you sound so surprised? Didn't you know about it? Oh, of course I did. I, I, I did. I did. But forgive me, I've just been very busy lately. It just... I seem to be very forgetful. This is why I keep telling you to sometimes take a break. Don't you walk yourself to death. I won't, Mommy. I won't. Okay, so Saturday next week is, um, what, dinner? Yes. And that's why I'm calling ahead of time to let you know. If you have anything on that day, clear it. Okay, <clears throat> mommy. Okay, so Saturday is a is a date. I have to I have to go now. There's somebody at the door. In fact, clear your calendar for the whole week. That will make it much better. You don't need to be too disheartening. I only accompany her, so you are not going to be an obstacle. Since the wedding is by the corner. I want her to be close to my son. At least another vulture tries to get in. This will always be Liz's house. She belongs here. I just hope she realizes the mistake on time that you're brainwashing her to make. Mistake? <laughs> Did I hear you say mistake? I thought you said you were sisters. Shouldn't you be happy that she's getting married? For crying out loud, you've had your own fair share at love and marriage. You should be happy she's settling down too. I'm happy. I'm excited. I'm thrilled as a matter of fact. It is your son that I don't trust. What are the odds? What if he jumps right, right after marriage and starts cheating on her? Oh, watch your thong. Watch your word, young lady. My son is a decent gentleman. It's you. You actually turned him into the man that he was. Really? Oh, yes. You do not need to worry about me, Catherine. You don't need to worry about that happening because he won't. Jeffrey will not cheat on me. And I won't be like you who couldn't keep her husband and let another woman destroy her home. Are you done? Yes. I am done here. There's nothing left between us. So see you when I see you. Mom? Darling. Let's go. I'm holding on what I know is right. I'm not backing off from the truth. 
truth My yesterday might not be too smooth But I know tomorrow holds something good I'm holding on what I feel is right I'm not backing up from the truth My yesterday might not be too smooth But I know tomorrow holds something Good morning, sir. Mr. Stephen is asking for the files I brought to you earlier. Mr. Nozzy. Mr. Nozzy. Jeff! Yeah, uh, sorry. What do you want? The files I brought to you earlier. Mr. Stephen needs them before he gets a dent to the financial department. Yeah, uh. Just um, give me, you, you know, just come back, okay? Let me work on it. But not to worry, I'll call, I'll call Stevens now and talk to him myself. So are you okay? I mean, you've been acting a little different lately. Or is it the wedding preparation? I'm fine, I'm okay. Nothing. Hey, what's up? Uh, good morning, sir. Uh, good morning, Paul. How are you? Sir, I'll just, uh, uh Steven, just give me a second, okay? Hey, I'm good. So, how about this evening? Are you up for a drink? I was thinking we... No, 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 I'm not up for that. I just want to focus on this file. Get it done for Stevens, then I go home straight, okay? Uh, Stevens. No, I can see you right here. Can you just give me, like, uh, 30 minutes to get it done? More, please. You're you spoiling me too much, more. Please. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, hey. Mother. So, this is the woman you finally succeeded in forcing on my brother. Watch your mouth. That's your brother's wife. Brother's wife. The last I checked, there is no ring on his finger. She's not his wife yet. Adobe. No, mom. I am not going to sweep this under the carpet or shut up like we've done all our lives. Now listen to me, young woman. It's Lizzie. My name is Elizabeth. Elizabeth. Good. I want you to answer me in all honesty. When last did you see my brother truly happy? I mean, when last did you see him truly smile? Why would you ask me? That? Answer me, please. When last did you see him happy? <laughs> I I truly do not know where this is going to. I mean, all of this, but I can assure you, my fiance and I are okay. We are very happy. That's it. Mm. And it would be our greatest joy if you would grace us with your presence on our special day. There you have your answer. Now, can you stop being a pompous of a protective sister? I will appreciate it if we go through this Saturday without you spoiling anything for me. In an alien Hey, babe. You can now. Hi, brother. <laughs> Surprise? <laughs> Welcome. Bless you. <laughs> well, that's such a warm welcome coming from a girl. Congratulations, mother. You succeeded. <laughs> oh, brother! Come on, there. Come on, yes. pay her no attention. Um, now put a smile on that face. Your day is coming, son. Put a smile on that face. Don't worry, he will come, come over. <laughs> 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 That's it. Don't worry. 
You have nothing to worry about. To go ahead with this. You're not backing out. You speak as if there is a way out already. Well, there is. You clearly don't love this woman. No, sister, I don't. But the one I love decided not to see me again. That's because you're not owning up to the consequences of your actions. You are, you are clearly living a life that mom drafted for you. Ever since you were a child, you've always done and lived according to her terms. Listen, brother. You're a man now. A full man. It's high time you start making your own decisions and living by its consequences. Well, Adobe, I made a decision. I made a decision and... And now here I am living with the consequences. No. You are facing consequences of choices that you didn't make. You, you were trying to play it safe. Now, look at the mess you've created. It's only you that can remedy it. It's only you. I'm holding on what I know is right. I'm not backing off from the truth. My yesterday might not be Look at you. I'll be coming back. So just keep yourself busy, okay? Okay? Let me. Wow! Who do we have here? How are you doing? Okay. Yes, I can see you. Okay. Mom! Yeah. Mom. Yeah. You see? See where you're like. Mom, where did you get these caterers? They're so unprofessional. Huh. Easy. Easy. Calm down. Calm down. You're going to be hypertensive if you begin to look at those things there. She's you right. just calm down. I know. You just... They are catras. Huh? They can handle it. Let them do their job. Okay? I'm just worried. Um, Jeff is such a picky eater. I don't want to have running stomach after eating here. <laughs> really? Really? Did you notice anything? Um, I'll just go and see what's going on in the kitchen. Okay, you're free. Hey, you're looking beautiful every day. Where is it? What's happening? Do you notice anything? No, nothing. There's nothing. Class, calm down. Are you joining me? No, I don't want to join you. Let me join these girls. They will be doing something else. Come, 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 come. Mom! Dad! Mommy? Dad, they're here! Oh, it's come with sweetie. <laughs> Mom! Dad! They're here! Wow! Ooh. Wow! <laughs> so You're welcome! <laughs> Good how you doing? Hi. Yes, sir. Son? Yes, sir. How are you doing? Fine, ma. Welcome. Thank you. Oh. Thank you for coming. Mom, Please. Daddy, this is Jeffrey, my fiancé, and his mother, Mrs. Anosi. Jeff, these are my parents, Mr. and Mrs. Anosiki, and my sister, Catherine. Uh, well, well, I'm pleased to meet you. Your sister and I are no longer strangers, are we? Yeah. <laughs> well, I must say, you both raised a wonderful lady in Elizabeth. Oh, thank you, Mom. <laughs> thank you so much. <laughs> Please sit, sit, thank sit, you. sit. sit. <laughs> yeah, you're welcome to our humble abode, Madam Ifoma. <laughs> oh, please, Ifoma is just fine. <laughs> really? Yes. And Marilyn is fine by me, too. <laughs> yes. After all, we're going to be in-laws, so... 
There will be no need for those formalities. Oh, mm -hmm. Son, you're welcome. Thank you, ma. Thank you. <laughs> Son, have I met you somewhere before? I don't think this is the first time we're meeting. Are you a banker? Yeah, sort of. I'm an investment banker. I work with Glitz and Gold Investment. Assets? Investment assets? Yeah. How come you don't know me? I'm not exactly sure. But probably I came in the period you left. Wait. I'm not sick. No way. Mr. Walter Anosike. Yes. Wow. You remember? I remember you, you, you bought All Hearts Resort. Exactly. Oh my God. How could you not forget? You remembered. <laughs> well, how can I forget you? I've been deeply involved in investment for decades. But one time, I was a few seconds away from sinking millions of Naira that would have sucked me dry from nowhere. A rookie analyst appears, fights with his superior just to get me to listen. That counter bid you made that day got me to where I am today. It's an event I'm not ready to forget in a hurry. I thank God that I listened to you on that day. I'm glad you listened, sir. Brilliant, boy. Just a small word. Mm. You're welcome. Mm. I was thinking. Yes. It's going to be a double celebration. How does this Christmas sound? It's going to be amazing, isn't it? Two celebrations. Yes, oh. what do you think? I think Christmas is a bit far. I was actually looking at August, September. Our children have both in love with each other. I don't see the need for a long wait. Mom? Mm. Son, I'm actually considering your position, you know. You told me you can't wait to be with your bride, right? Elizabeth, darling, what do you say? <laughs> okay, I think... August is a little too soon. It's not a short golden wedding, isn't it? No, Mom, it's not. I'm not pregnant. Good. So I was imagining how I could get your sister's wedding gown to fit into. Oh, no. About that, oh, no, please. I wouldn't want her to wear any kind of cheap, outdated, classless wedding gown. Elizabeth is a special child. Everything she's going to wear on that day will be new. That's what someone has worn. I mean, you want her to share the same fate with the first one? No. Hey, former. I can assure you that the wedding gown is not updated at all. Oh, but it's, that's no problem. There's no problem. If you don't want her to wear that, we can make arrangement for a new one. Oh, fine. Isn't it? Yes. yes. We can. But see, you know what I think? That both of you are spending unnecessary time for a discussion that does not involve you. <laughs> and what I mean is that the bride and the groom are yet to agree as to a date for their wedding. Of course. And until they do, all this talk is Can we enjoy our my yesterday might not be too smooth But I know tomorrow holds something good I'm holding on what I feel is right I'm not backing off from the truth my yesterday might not be too smooth, but I know tomorrow holds something hey. good. No pain from yesterday. 
Is there anything I can do for you? Um, I just, um, I just came to say thank you for today. You handled everything well. It's nothing. That's why we are family. So, um, are you going to tell them? Excuse me. Tell, tell them what? Kachu, you know what I mean. No, I, don't, I just want to understand what part you want me to start telling them. I, I'm, I'm curious. Is it, is it the part where your husband to be dated the both of us and we had no idea? Is it the part you want, you want me to start from? Or you want me to start from the part where we both found out and then you blamed me for it? Elizabeth, what part? I'm still wondering what part you want me to start from. And need I remind you that you moved out and you never took a second glance at that house. Is that where you want me to start from? Oh, need I remind you, you insulted me. And you blamed me for ending my marriage. I just, I just, I just need to understand what part exactly do you want me to start from? What did you just say? What did you just say? Mommy, it's not that serious. What happened? What is it, Mary? Ask your daughters. Catherine, do you care to repeat to your father's hearing what you just said? Have you suddenly gone down? What, honey? Talk to me. They are dating the same man. Eh? Yes. Jeffrey's shitting on two sisters. When Elizabeth found out, she left the house. What? Elizabeth, is this true? Elizabeth, speak. She was the reason Jeff cheated on me. Jeff has nothing to do with this. You can twist this into as many yarns as you like, but it still doesn't change the fact about what happened. The only reason why this is my fault is because I didn't open up to you about my relationship from the beginning. Because if I did, we would have known. Right? No, you knew, Catherine. Yes, you knew. That was why you kept it a secret, because you knew there was no way his mother was going to approve of you two. Isn't that why you're trying so hard to sabotage this one happiness I've got? What? Sabotage? How dare you talk to your sister like that? With all she did for you? I knew it. I knew you guys never truly cared for me. Huh? But it's all right. It's fine. I will send you the wedding invitation card once it's out. Don't you dare leave this house. Unbelievable. Catherine. You've been going through all this alone, all this time, without telling anyone. I wonder how you felt when you saw him at dinner table tonight. Mommy, it wasn't that bad. I need to go to sleep now. Oh, God. It's shocking. I think it's still not late for you to call this shit off. Just go down there, call your mom, call everyone and tell them the truth. It's not that easy, bro. I mean, we've gone too far to go back. Cards has been printed. Kick selected. Venue booked. It's too late now, bro. I can't. Okay, let me even ask you something. What have you done in this whole arrangement? Everything done by your mom. It practically means this is not your wedding. Simple. No, no, no. I can't. 
Bro, I can't. I, I can't hurt my mom. Are you serious? You can't hurt your mom, but you, you can spend the rest of your life with a, with a woman you will absolutely feel nothing for. Oh God, this is not wedding. As far as I'm concerned, this is bondage, but for you and her. <clears throat> Food is ready. Let's eat. All right. We'll be there shortly. Let's go eat, bro. All right. I made you an extra box since you know. Oh, you shouldn't have. I can always get my own food. Yeah, I know. By the way, it's empty. I'll just go straight to the point here, Chooks. Keep your numerous advice to yourself while at it. I beg your pardon. Oh, you heard me. You're the best man, so stick to it rather than doing something else. Have a nice day. Yeah, <laughs> good to see you. How are you doing? <laughs> see what we have here. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. What are you doing here? <laughs> Please sit down. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. I was in town and the designer I hired for your wedding gown wants to make arrangement for its fitting. I called, but you weren't picking up, so I decided to come and check and see if you're all right. My gown? Yes, your wedding gown. The one you like best. Oh, you didn't think I would allow your mother-in-law to steal that one glory from me, do you? Baby, it's every mother's dream to see your beautiful beloved daughter walk down the aisles of the man she loves with that same gown you chose for her looking radiant <laughs> excuse me okay thank you <laughs> yeah i miss you so much mommy we all miss you and we love you too much so much Yes, Lizzie, it is your wedding. It is your wedding we are planning. Must we fight? Are we supposed to be fighting? Then come home. Come home. Now listen, are you planning to make your wedding arrangements in your husband's house? You know I can't, mommy. It's best for everyone. Um, enough of all this. It's fine. <laughs> oh, the buy off are you? <laughs> you know exactly what I take. <laughs> so whatever you bring, I'll take. Okay. What the hell, Ikena? Are you out of your mind? Tell what me. are you doing? Tell me not to go, okay? T -t Tell me not to go. Tell me not to marry her, please. I can't do that. That would be, be me being selfish. But I don't love her. It is you that I love, please. Don't, don't make me choose her forever, okay? Just tell me not to marry her, please. You're not being selfish. This is you fighting for love. 
Unless you're telling me you never felt anything for me. Please, tell me something. See? Tell me you feel my heart beating. Tell me you feel the love. I, I just want to know it's the same. Please, just tell me not to marry her and I won't. Then, then don't. Don't marry her. Don't, don't. Don't leave me. I'm here. I'm not going anywhere, okay? I'm, I'm here. Okay. I'm not going. I'm not going anywhere. Can you stop wishing? You know this won't be happening. By the way, the wedding is taking place in two days. And if he loves you like he said he does, then he won't go on with it. dream is this? What is this? What forbid? No. Yes. Fine, fine. What about the caterers? Everybody must be on point. Photographer, they must be there on time. I try me now. Yes. Okay. No, no, don't bother yourself about that. Yes. Everybody must be on point. That's what I want, yes. <sighs> Let me call you back later. You look so beautiful. Oh my God. <laughs> this is beautiful. I bet my brother will not be able to recognize you tomorrow. I <laughs> bet my son is already growing impatient. He can't wait to take you down the altar tomorrow. I know. <laughs> hey, if we say make your neck cozy. Again, a day. Hey, I'm not cozy. Good afternoon, Mrs. Sanders. You're supposed to be at the hotel preparing for your bachelor's eve. <laughs> oh, you're right, Ma. Um, I'm here to tell you that I have no hand in the recent development. Nkabuluzegini, what are you talking about? Uh, Ike now walked out on us at the hotel saying he can no longer continue with the wedding tomorrow. Yes, ma. Driver! Huh? Driver, where is he? Oh, come here! Open the door! Open the gates! Open the gates! Move, move, move! Let's go! Let's go! Move! Oh, God. Drive! Daddy. 
Yes, mommy. Come on. Come on, get the door. Someone is there. Ikena, what are you doing here? Uh, where is your father? I need to talk to him. My father? What do you want from my father? So, so um... I'm so sorry. Good day, ma'am. Good day. I'm sorry to bad you. Wait, wait. I need to talk to your husband, please. Please sit down, sit down, sit down. I don't think it's necessary. I... Who is your father? This happens. Sir, uh, good day, sir. Good day. Please, I'm, I'm sorry, sir. But please, uh, there's something important I need to discuss with you. Very well, son. Come on. Thank you. What's going on? I don't know. Come on, mommy, be serious. You know, you can't hear anything from there. What's going on? Is he calling off the wedding already? <laughs> he does not. I'll rip the skin off his back if he leaves my sister at the altar. Who's that? What are you doing here dressed like that? Did you guys plan to meet here? Hey! Stop hey. it! Stop it! What is wrong with you? Do you want to slap your elder sister? What I should have done long ago. Slap her to the reality that no matter what she does, Jeff will never be hers. What are your plans, Katri? To steal my man? And of all this, I went if? That's preposterous. Is it, Mom? Is it? So tell me why Jeff chose to do all this, to act funny. She never wanted me to be happy. That is why she keeps sabotaging all my opportunities. I have been nothing but good to you since the day we met. You remember that night? I came through for you. All right. If it wasn't for me that night, you would have been long dead. Do you hear me? If you forgot it so soon, you were gang raped right in my presence. You were brutally assaulted as an underage child, and I stood for you. And now you have the effort to ask, to question my sincerity and my love for you. I didn't ask you to save me. You should have left me to die. I didn't ask for all of this. I didn't tell you to tell your parents to adopt me. I was fine on my own. I could have survived on my own. I see how you survived all right. Sleeping with numerous men and getting pregnant and not even knowing who the father of the child is. The abortion that almost cost you your life! Elizabeth! I'll say for you! Elizabeth! And if I, if I don't mean for you to be happy, I would have told the that you're a single mother just like me. But this said I made him and every other person believe that Abubay is also my biological child. What? Are you saying Abubay is Elizabeth's child? Yes, mommy. <laughs> Remember when I told you we were going to Ghana? With Shineme and, 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 and Elizabeth. It was because we were hiding our pregnancy! Jeez. And now you're here! You hit me! For what? After everything I've done! Please. Sorry, excuse me. What's the reason? There's no reason for you to blame your sister for anything, okay? I came here on my own. I came to tell your father I'm not interested in this marriage. Yes. <laughs> and not because the woman I love refused to have anything to do with me, no. But because I am not ready to tie myself down with this bondage called marriage with you. I won't do it. I won't do it. Your mother. I know you meant well for me. I know, but these past few weeks I've been asking myself, do I really want this? Can I live the rest of my life with this? And mom, I can't, I'm sorry, I can't do it, okay? Please.
this all alone and you did not even you didn't want to tell me oh sorry Kathy you didn't even care to tell your I'm sorry Kathy I'm sorry mommy oh god come down <laughs> I'll be fine daddy I could never take a man you know that right Calm down, okay? Just calm down. It's okay. It's okay. I'll be fine. Hey! Chineke Namdiko. Hey! Hey! One that's the say shall never end. So this is her real face. Look at me. Hi. You can't say I'm mad. Look at me trying to force my son into marrying that wretched, damaged ingrate for daughter-in-law. Hey? See how God exposed her. If you get. Hey, thank God for exposing her. You're not different, mom. What? Let's face it. She may have done all these bad things and wrong things to her sister, but you've done so much to this family as well. It's a guinea. Yes. Yes, mom. I mean, you ought to be curious, are you not? Why you have grown-up kids who refuse you coming to visit them all the time because whenever you visit us, you choke us out. You just want to choke the life out of us. No. And all this started because you wanted a pawn for your son. And yet, you will not still settle for less. You, you want perfection. And that's what has gotten us into this mess. Ikena, you deserve the best as my son. But I'm imperfect. I'm imperfect. Okay, nobody's perfect. You're, you're not. Adobe is not. I'm not. Nobody's perfect. So why should we judge? We're not God. I only want the best for you. And, and mom, pray she doesn't do something stupid. Because if she does, it's on you. Mm -hmm. Mom, you know he's not wrong. You know. Excuse me, Mom. Welcome, Ikenna. Yeah, ma'am. Oh, Guinea. something I'm not 
start backing off from the truth. My yesterday might not be too smooth, but I know tomorrow holds something good. I'm holding on what I feel is right. You know the door is always open for you whenever you're ready to come back. I'm sorry, I, I should go. See. How long do you intend to continue running? I mean, every time I see you come here and then you just turn and leave each time you come. See, this is your home, Liz. You don't have to continue to run. You don't deserve to be here. You don't deserve to be my sister. Well, we don't deserve a lot of things that happen to us, but they still happen anyway. See, Daddy and Mommy are worried about you. The kids miss you. I miss you. We all miss you. Please. Uh, will you ever forgive me? But I know tomorrow holds something good. I'm holding on what I feel is right. I'm not backing up from the truth. My yesterday might not be too smooth. Oh, man. Going somewhere. I'm leaving. You're leaving to where? I still have a house again. Yeah. You've been staying here for so long I forgot. You're a visitor. I'm your mother. I can never be a visitor in my son's house. Yeah, right. Why are you leaving? I never asked you to leave. You don't need to ask me. I don't know who the lucky one will be anymore. Honestly, I don't really care to know. As long as the person makes you extremely happy, your happiness means a lot to me. You deserve to be happy. You truly deserve to be happy. to do is to make sure uh, yeah no, I need six different dishes okay, six yeah ready from African continental you, you already know 
Yeah. 6 p.m. tomorrow, 6 p.m. All right, thank you very much. Well, that is too much food for such a small gathering. You should let me do the cooking. Baby, it's your family and my family, okay? And everyone has their likes and dislikes. I want to carry everyone along. Yeah, but you know we'll save some money if I do the cooking, right? Am I complaining? Am I complaining? Hey, come here. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Hey, uh, <laughs> how are you? Come here. Uh, come here, what is the problem? Hmm? What is it? What is it? Hey, look at me. What is it? Talk to daddy. Everybody come. What is the problem? Oh, yes. Come here. Mm. Okay. What is it? Hmm? Come on, talk to daddy. But, but, man. It's a monster. It crawls under people's bed and scares them. Good people's bed, but it's people's bed. Yes, of course, the boogeyman is a monster who crawls under people's bed and scares them like. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what? Yeah. Hey, honey, I got this, okay? I got this. Yeah, you, know, you should tell them that the boogeyman does not exist. What? That is what you should tell them. No, the boogeyman exists. What are you saying? They should be scared of the boogeyman. I am the boogeyman right here. <laughs> <laughs> now I got this, okay? I got this. Are you sure? I got this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I got this, I got this. <laughs> hey, look, look, look. Tomorrow. 